feel to have your track Panic Room reach over 40 million streams? Absolutely insane. <laughs> okay, Are you going to release a follow-up EP or album to your 2018 release X Games? <laughs> That's a very good question. I uh, don't know. <laughs> okay. Uh... Name your top five anime shows. Oh my gosh. Uh, Fairy Tale, um, uh, Seven Deadly Sins, uh, Seraph of the End. Uh, oh my gosh. Yona of the Dawn, Norigami. That was so hard. Okay. Uh, what do you hope to achieve as an artist? That's always like such a hard question. Like, what are your goals? Like, of course I have goals, but it's so hard to like pinpoint exactly what that is sometimes. I would say I hope that I can play live in front of more people because I love playing live. And uh, yeah, let's just say that. Okay. Uh, if you could lend your musical talents to any anime show, which would it be? I love this question so much. Um, I would say, Ooh, that's so hard. There's this anime called Violet Evergarden on Netflix, which is amazing, and the visuals are so cool, and I feel like I'd be very inspired to write something for that, so. Let's just say that. Okay. Which artist helped you sh blah, blah, blah. That's not right. Thank <laughs> you for doing that. Which artist helped shape you growing up? To be honest, our undergrounder. Not even gonna lie. <laughs> Not even gonna lie. I love her so much. Um, describe your sound in three words or less. Uh, uh, metaphorical alt pop. I don't know. I use a lot of metaphors in my songs. A lot of like weird concepts and stuff. I don't know if that makes any sense. We're just gonna go with that. Um, got a couple more. What do you love most about songwriting? Uh, to be honest, songwriting can be such a pain in the butt sometimes because you just like, you end up overthinking so many things about it and, and just, I'm such a perfectionist that I like could continue working on a song forever, um, but I also love it so much. Um, so I would say just coming up with the concept and like putting it together and finally getting it like right is uh, probably my my favorite part of songwriting. <laughs> Hopefully, getting it right. Okay. Um, what is your dream venue to play? Ooh, it's a good one. Um, I'd probably say, I've seen like a lot of shows at the O2 Arena, I think it'd be really cool to play there. I have played there before like as a guest vocalist, but it'd be cool to do like a headline thing there one day, maybe, if we get there. Let's see, I'm just gonna say that one. <laughs> when did you realize you wanted to pursue music? <sighs> to be honest, I didn't really know that I could like do it as a job which is so weird that that's my job, what even. Um, and I think I only really realized that I was able to do it as a job when I was like like 13 and I'm 17 now. So yeah, that was like four years ago. But I knew that I wanted to do something in music when I was 10. That's like when I started recording YouTube covers. They weren't that good, don't look for them. This, yeah. They're scraped off of the internet, so. Anyways, I think that's it. <laughs> 